if you want to be a better person, a better Muslim or a better Sufi, grow your own food. You know what's in that food. You've nurtured it. You value that food more. You value life more. Sharing that with somebody is sharing what you've actually been part of. And that's pleasing to one's heart really, isn't it? It gives you a sense of achievement that you've done something, not just for yourself, but for somebody else. That's what it's about. Gardening is essentially really creative. I often think if you're not careful, you can see the rubbish and down at heel properties or whatever, but actually if, you, if you're a gardener or if you've done any gardening, I think you're drawn to seeing what people create. You know, there are a lot of examples on all the streets of people who wanted to create beautiful spaces for themselves. And actually it always snowballs because you always find that if there's one really nice garden, it's never one. They've always influenced their neighbours. I've always been involved in volunteering and that has actually kept me really active. I'm actually involved in maintaining this ground and that gets me, particularly during the summer, that gets me really physically active. And also it's, it's particularly satisfying as well when you spend a whole day cutting the grass and, and doing all the edges and cutting the square and preparing a wicket. And when you stand back at the end of the day and you look back, it's very satisfying. So personal social benefit is very important. For example, we've got plenty of fruit trees around and obviously we couldn't have that all to ourselves. So what we did was we got the group down, got their mums in, and just shared it, let them have a fruit picking day and the kids absolutely loved it because a lot of them don't have access to being able to go somewhere and pick their own fruit. Giving and receiving makes you feel good, <laughs> I think. A couple of the women brought in a bag of plums that their mother-in-law gave them. I made some jam with them and I gave them back the jam. The food that you're having, you're growing, it's organic. It's about sharing. Look what I have achieved. Look what is possible. And it's not about my lack of ability to do something, but my ability to do something. A lot of people of the weekend are going to come here and enjoy a game of cricket. And that satisfaction that you get is something that actually keeps you going, both mentally and physically as well. And that's the key thing actually because that's one of the reasons why we set up the groups was that people are not isolated, that they come together helping one another grow and it's sometimes you can grow something and it might not even grow but you've been part of that activity and that's the most important thing. We need to kind of talk up the positive things, you know, talk up about the amazingly abundant pear tree on Kensington Street or the beautiful gardens on Washington Street and tell people about them. So the benefits are not small, they're huge. And the World Wide Web can give you so many ideas. You know, you can grow almost anything, anywhere.